Beep boop, boop beep, beep boop. Mm -hmm. It looks like it's time to get started. I totally forgot to run an ad this time, so I'm not sure when the ads are going to automatically run now. Hopefully not too often, I hope. I should probably consider getting myself a Steam Deck eventually. That way I can automatically switch games on the floor, or switch the scenes on the fly. Minimize the amount of lag that we'll encounter. So far, so good, it looks like. Here we go. Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to Lull's Time and tonight's episode of At Our Adventures at Outward. I'm going to attempt to use my 3D model while playing again, even though I know we've had some serious difficulties doing that in the past. I'm just missing it a little too much, I think. I know when we first started playing this game, we used to do it with the 3D model, chiefly, and we've always run, and it's went well for a while until up until we got to the city of Berg, and then just started like lagging like a motherfucker. So I switched down to the 2D PNG for a while, but it's just not the same, don't you think? We'll see how good or bad it is tonight. If it becomes truly unbearable again, I will just switch back to the 2D PNG. So I apologize in advance. Hopefully that will not be need to not be necessary though. Hopefully. As always, let me know if there are any rendering problems with the game or with my model. Well, okay. At the very least. Oh, well that problem is still present, isn't it? That's has to say running forward and not being able to stop. So I guess some things really don't change. It's more of a, it seems to be a latency issue, because you can clearly see that I'm able to, like, both the game and my model are running relatively smoothly, right? But I'm looking at my CPU right now, and I could see that um, CPU usage is going through the roof again. Temperatures aren't that bad, but who knows? 
if that will change or something. But we'll see how things go. So when we last left off, I had adventured all the way back here to the city of Monsoon, finished up the remains of my skills over there at the shopkeep, and then decided on what my next move should be. I got a pretty decent axe here. I got some interesting new toys. Thank you for throwing something at my face, bread wife. How are you doing tonight? Welcome to the stream. And I'm curious if I should invest in the Chakram skills. I got the pizza. I got a really awesome Chakram. Probably the best in the game. It's currently in my house down in Abyssar Desert. Oh, here we go. So the first thing we need to do is actually go check out, let's go solve this issue. Finding the bandit hideout and the expiring cliffs in the hollowed marshes west. And cleaning them out. See who it was that was responsible for attempting to murder the people here and start another war. Doing good? How am I? I'm doing pretty well. I got decent sleep for once last night. Um, and I'm here. I do not, I do not exaggerate when I say I look forward to these streams every evening. Um, so things are pretty good. I just wish that my CPU was more was uh, young and fresh and able to handle the um, handle the difficulties of running a game like this and also uh, running VTuber programs and also running OBS. But alas, it is fairly old, so the fact that it's lasted this long is probably kind of like. It's probably a surprise in itself. I'm thinking that since this game already looks pretty damn good as it is, maybe I can just uh, swallow my pride and reduce the quality down to like medium or something. Or at least to high. Not much of a difference, is there? Things are still quite shiny. Model still looks decent. Sword still looks decent. My main concern is... It looks like it's doing fine, but there's some um, input lag when I'm... And I don't know... I'm assuming that the input lag is from rendering my model, the two mo model in two different programs, and re rendering OBS, and also rendering the game. So I wonder if there is any way to reduce that, like reducing it to medium, maybe. Honestly, even at medium settings, it looks pretty damn good, doesn't it? But the way I see it, it's still doing that. It's that's still a problem, you know. In fact, this issue has caused me to die, if not die, then almost die quite a few times. So, there's been no change in this, um, in this, uh, concern where there's an input lag going on. Regar it's, I'm almost starting to wonder if it really is not a matter of, it's probably, it really is, probably isn't a matter of quality settings, it's probably a matter of that's just how. That's just how these uh, Unity programs interact. But I mean, in the city of Berg, it's pretty nasty, right? Hey, Vimboy, how are you doing tonight? It's a miracle worker. <laughs> well, I don't like to. Uh, I don't like to brag, but how are you guys doing tonight? Welcome to the stream. Man, my model is getting is really choppy right now. Like, nobody's business. Like, extremely choppy. According to my computer, CPU usage is maxing out at 100 right now. That's pretty bad. I guess 
no one has really complained that I've switched to PNG tubers on Wednesdays and I've had some decent viewership in spite of not having running a 3D model on Wednesdays. So I guess until I just um, do start dual streaming or dual PC streaming, I'll just have to grin and bear it. <laughs> of course, that means I'll need to get back onto Discord, huh? Oh no, Lulz has become a transparent black box. What shall we do? All right. Testing, one, two, three. Hmm, that's weird. Do I need to, why is it stuck in a black box mode? Does it take a while for um, the thing to realize that I'm here? Do I need to actually log back into back into uh, reactive images? Oh, there it is. There am I. It just took a while. All right. The things we do for VTubing chat. On the bright side, I'm quite small and huggable and lovable. I still have two breakthrough points, and it's clear that I'm going to need a lot more than what I currently have in order to find victory against stronger baddies in this game. So I need to decide on what other classes I'm going to invest in. I think I'll invest in at least one other mage class and at least one Greetings, friend. other melee, one other uh, melee class. If I invest in this, it actually I don't need to worry about mana as much, but still just constantly regain mana over time. And I can increase my resistance to fire damage and increase fire damage you inflict by 15%. And also learn how to create ice learn how to create ice circles on the ground. Which is really cool. Of course I can also just kill the shit out of people with chakrams, which would be insane, right? And these require discipline too, which is really cool. So basically it requires a thing from the other side. This one though is an awesome spell. Makes you immune to damage for a short time. Or I can just set fire on the a sigil on the ground of fire and blow stuff up. This would go really well with the flamethrower spell I got, you know? Since I clearly favor using, um, comp per, I clearly favor doing melee attacks in this game, and I just prefer using magic to augment myself instead of just using ma instead of relying on magic Thor and entirely, I probably should just keep that keep it that way. I'll get one magic spell maybe, and I'll just focus on using these things. I also need to decide though, like... I need to like, either get a better claymore, forge a better claymore, or I need to just uh, say fuck claymores and rely chiefly on sword and shield style. Sword and shield style is definitely better for my health, I'll tell you that much. But, I don't know. 
It's kind of enthralling to use swords, honestly. Especially two-handed hey, swords. And part of that is the fact that I don't typically use two-handed swords in games like this. Alternatively, me yeah, I can just get good and learn to use Master of Motion properly. This one apparently does a sh is should in theory be good for getting out of sticky situations. But, I don't know how good it is, honestly. And this one's dumb. I already have a counter-attack. Lunging attack that ignores all defenses and conflicts pain. This one would probably... I'm wondering if I should have gotten Perfect Strike instead. Honestly. So. Greetings, friend. Curious. This worries me. Damn. Okay, so I do know I need to go. Greetings, friend. Hmm. Still, I would like to have some fire resistance. Oh well. We're gonna wait until dawn because, from personal experience, trying to make our way through the marsh. Really late in the evening is fucking hard as shit. If I've learned anything from Dark Souls Think Pieces, it's that shields are put into games specifically to not be used. Really? I mean, is that because shields are not properly implemented in other games? Because in this game, it's very useful. It works very well. Like, and there's also the sheer number of skills that require the shield. I got into like, there's like half a dozen that I've seen personally. There's probably more. Is... A little bit and obscene. <laughs> so, I don't know. I don't know. Whoa, I just realized something. My axe lights up the ground. Okay, you see, that's just a really cute detail I wouldn't have expected. Let's go to bed, chat. How are you doing tonight, Steel? You having a good night? <laughs> do, 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 do. Can we get a drink of water before we uh, plan today's adventure? Our first quest, we're gonna go ahead and deal with this bandit problem that's going on outside. Fairly typical, I would say, of of adventures like these. I'm gonna go talk to all the townspeople again really quick, see if they have any quests to give me. Greetings, friend. Do you have anything interesting today? Beast Golem scraps? Yeah, I could use some Beast Golem scraps actually. Do I have anything I can unload on you so I don't have as much, don't use, have as much space in here? My food's starting to rot. That's no Breno. I always need my teas. Gonna keep the assassin elixir for now. Alright, you could have my mana stone. How about them apples? Do I have any... I need to make sh I have around six travel rations. That should be good for me for now. It's a joke. H Bomber guy put out a video that's hours long defending D DS2 and half of it was shield is bad. Maybe he maybe he's the one that's bad. Is there <laughs> something you need? I'm kidding. I don't know who that person is, so I can't comment on them. Hmm. Is there anything interesting here that I can build? Charge toxic. Poison po poison varnish. No. All right. What I should be doing, 
since I'm clearly not going to be able to carry all this crap with me. Or, or rather, I shouldn't get lost with all this crap with me. Now, one second. I better cook this meat before it spoils. Could always use more meat stews, right? Should also help reduce weight because marshmallows are he really heavy. See? I already regained 5 pounds. It's kind of ridiculous, actually. Just gonna check all my guns to make sure they're all properly loaded. Okay, that one's still loaded. Cool. So, we got the... And part of the reason I am kind of on edge about using my two-handed sword in this area is because of the fucking dinosaurs. The dinosaurs are such bitch asses, let me tell you. Um, hmm. Going to replace this skill, actually. And I should replace it with Flash Onslaught. Instead of using Brace, I uh, will instead... Use this as a Hail Mary. Full of Grace. And I'm gonna go ahead and go to the general store really quick and purchase a small bag to put my excess garbage in. <laughs> How can I help you? How can I use the plan? Sewell's general store in Levant's in need of his ledger. Sure, I was gonna head yes. back there anyway. Later. And what we got here? What we got here? A trader's backpack for 250. I can carry up to 100 pounds worth of garbage. And also an adventurer's backpack, which allows you to carry a few things and also makes it easier to dodge. This is obviously the thing that they want you to play with when you go out. But I just uh, I have a hard time doing that because you end up finding that you need a lot of the items in the game. But it's also fairly cheap, and when I go out hunting, I'm going to be able to carry back a lot of um, a lot of dinosaur, a lot of uh, carcasses and such. We might actually. I want to see how much stuff we can uh, craft using like, raw materials from the dinosaurs outside, because we got a lot of spare materials and stuff. I don't think it actually interferes with dodge that much, to be perfectly honest. I think that's kind of a meme that it's you can't that it interferes with dodge. But still, this is so expensive. I mean, I know it got a lot of gold here. This is still around twenty two thousand. So this is still around two thousand eight hundred silver. But you know, fire varnish. All right, that's high. I feel like that's highway robbery, but you do you. What can I do for you? And this is for crafting a Tarnasar Great Axe for a two-handed weapon. Uh, gold Lich Sword would be cool. Actually, I purchased the thing for making a Gold Lich uh, two-handed sword. If I do manage to make one of those, that's gonna be a fun time. I also have never used spears in this game, so I don't know how useful they are. My understanding is that they're great for stun locking the hell out of enemies, so maybe that would be an interesting thing to do. I do feel a little sluggish, I'm not gonna lie. Can I help you? Greetings, friend. Can I help you? Miasma pod right there. I 
Okay. That's weird. Why did it take a while for my tent to pop in just now? Hmm. Well, anyway. Gonna go drop this in the ground. Gonna open that up. Open my thing up here. And now we're going to dump everything that I don't immediately need. We're gonna be doing a lot of dinosaur hunting chat. But even still, this is kind of overkill in the arrows. I don't need, need that many arrows. Lulz, Dinosaur Hunter. We don't need this many water skins. We are just going to carry one thing of one bolt rag. Don't need any weather defense potions in the marshlands. Always need health potions. Uh, I don't need any assassin elixirs with me. Always keep the potions with you. Or the uh, teas with you. Don't need any ingredients, so we keep those. Don't need this either. Don't need these either. This is great for uh, curing poison, even though they're so heavy. I just need one of them, though. Because I already... Actually, I don't even need any of them because I already got antidotes here. This is also great for removing poison and disease, so I'm going to keep those around. And if you eat the alpha sandwich, it's going to give you, like, berserk, I think. Which would be very useful. Meat stew for keeping my stamina up. This is for restoring uh, mana. I don't need nine of these because I only got one pressure plate trap. And I don't know how to make pressure plate traps right now. So we're just going to keep one. Don't need this. Don't need that. And of course the golden scrap can stay as well. I don't want to lose all my gold, so we're going to keep that there, and put the silver away as well. And just like that, we've made room. And even though I've made room, there's still so much garbage in my pack. That's this game for you. We're going to swallow down some soup. We're going to go hunting. Also, yeah, and also we need to find those bandits, right? I also have something of a bone to pick with all the with the bandits in this game. I will, of course, hunt them to extinction to subsume their equipment and items for monies. Hmm. They have some interesting armor. Silver plate? Speaking of, do you think we'll see Dino Crisis remake or Turok remake first? I think Turok has a better chance, is probably going to come out first before Dino Crisis. But I think I heard a rumor that there is a new Dino Crisis coming up in the works, but I could be wrong. So, you know. Who knows, really? All right then. Purifier. So in a hub marshes west. I'm guessing it's over here where the huge tree is because I remember going to the west and running into a place full of bandits one time. I don't remember where that was, but. My understanding is it was not very far from where I lo met the travelers, so it's probably around here, or it's probably around here. Love your live notification. Haha, <laughs> memories of spam mail zero. I'm glad you enjoyed it, K-Chan. How are you doing tonight? Welcome to the stream. <laughs> I'm using a PNG tuber tonight because... Um, this game does not like me using my 3D avatar. <laughs> okay, I thought that was a dinosaur for a moment there.
I wonder how long this lasts. I like Torok as a character. Apparently the comics are really good. The comics are pretty good, even though they have nothing to do with the FPS games. To this day, I don't completely understand how the FPS games came to be anyway, since they have nothing to do with the comics. Except for the fact that they both have dinosaurs. Here are our first victims tonight, chat. This axe is ridiculous. I love it. I just, I just, I love this axe so much. Nothing, not very few things compared to it right now. <laughs> hey, didn't you have a mace? Give me your mace too, biatch. Come on. Ah, uh, he's not gonna give me my the mace. Sad face. I could sell these for a nice penny or two. Now, I should be going towards a huge tree right now. <clears throat> I don't know if that's the correct direction. It said to the west, and it also said that it should be up there some near some cliffs. That's a mana stone I can harvest later. It's fairly early in the morning, so I don't need to worry about sundown for a while. There's a campfire there. Some more bandages. And... I like that you can actually hit people from that far away. Oh, there's a Tyrannosaur right there. He's heading in this direction. If I can lure the Tyrannosaur to fight the bandits, I can just kill whoever is still left living. Less bullshit for me to deal with. It's kind of like the Ash William comics. There's no real reason he has to fight Freddy or Jason or be the one being here to some Marvel zombies. You know, that's a good point. Maybe I should invest in hunter skills since I insist on using the bow and arrow too so much. Your soul is mine. I heard a sound of clanging just now. Are they fighting? Yep, looks like the Tyrannosaur is fighting the Ice Witch. Whoever wins, they lose when I'm done with them. All right, stop, stop. He's dead. He's dead. Jeez. Oh my god, is Tyrannosaur actually running away? I'm out of arrows, chat. I make it look so easy, but let me tell you, these things are such a pain in the ass. I don't even want to fight them most of the time. But hey, free stuff. I'm... Here it is. This is where we continue from, chat. Um, it should be from over here. It should be to the west. So in this direction, I'm assuming, probably those ruins up there. Let me scoot in my chair a little bit. There's an iron spear here, which I could probably use to make a Phytosaur sword at some point. 
I'm also going to tear apart some of these things for items. Actually, let me see what we got going on here. I made a Fang Greatsword the other day. I figure you could turn the Fang Greatsword, you can use fang, the Fang Greatsword to turn it into something even cooler later. <laughs> the Fang, she looks dumb. Um, hmm. This is what I want to make. I have one of these at home. And these are easy to find. But what I really want is a Golem Rapier, but I need two of these. I don't got one of them. Hey, Winter. Aw. Well, I appreciate you stopping by anyway. How are you doing tonight? It inflicts poison on enemies. Using a Phytosaur Horn and using a Miasma Pod. Primitive Club. Scaled, scaled armor looks fun, actually. And these are easy to find. But I don't know where I'm going to find this. Such low resistances too, actually. But it does give you damage bonuses, which is fairly useful, I think. Really wish you could tear apart the simple bow. All right, chat. Let's see if we could find what happened to this uh, peasant, to this uh, to this um, traveler. Apparently, the mooks were have a base somewhere in this general direction, towards the hills. It said, so probably up there, I imagine. It's only 11.32, but it's still so dark. Ooh, dinosaurs. Gotta be careful with these species, though. Those things in particular are difficult to deal with. Thankfully, we have preparations. I don't think I even have any more. Oh, I got spooked for a second there because I thought I heard... Oh! Looks like two of the dinosaurs are fighting a Phytosaur right now. We're going to go ahead and loot the... or finish off the victors and loot the shit out of the losers. Looks like the Phytosaur was the loser this time. Let's go ahead and gently attract them in this direction or if they run off maybe we can just loot the body without having without even having to deal with them now nah, it's a little close let's uh hmm, i forgot to reload one second all right did i hit them or did i hit the rocks i think i hit the rocks chat Yeah, so these are some nasty boys, aren't they? And it looks like one of them has spotted me. But it doesn't know whether to attack or not. In the meanwhile, let us prepare ourselves. Good focus. And also, we're going to enrage a little bit. Okay. It looks like this one either enraged himself or... I hope the friend, their friend is not behind me. Looks like the other one just watched his friend die. What a traitor. Man, this axe is wonderful. <laughs> what do we got here? Looks like they weren't carrying much, just some marshmallows and some cacti fruit. How did they get cacti fruit all the way over here? Out here, anyway. That's what I want to know. Gonna loot their bodies. Gonna make a quick campfire. 
and cook them up some grub because in this climate, the meat will spoil very quickly because of all the bacteria. It is a marshland after all. We could also make more trip wires. And we're going to... Do I... Should I make bother... Make botherwood fire frags? Nah. I'm just going to make a campfire. Go ahead and have ourselves a quick snack, and then we'll continue our journey. And also a drink of water. Where are my water bags? There it is. Alright. Our bag's still overweight, but I think I feel fairly good about uh, fighting off these other dinosaurs over here. Preferably, while I still have advantage with my boons. Oh man, that one just got hit by knockback. I think they're suffering from pain. Oh, that one I actually flat out just killed one of them. Interesting. Things sure have changed from the last time I played for I've been here. Now I am the hunter. That one just keeled over and died all completely. Based. Looks like they're the prey now. Remember, kids, only you can start forest fires. Thankfully, we're in a marsh. So, no big deal here. <laughs> Alright. Got a lot of scales, though. Be nice to turn this scaled stuff into something, you know? A basic helmet says. I'm assuming from this that you can make a scaled leather hat by first making a hat. How do I make a hat, actually? So I need some hide. Okay. Right now, though, I'm kind of filled up. I wonder if I can just progress up there. I probably could, actually. Hmm. Alright, then. We're going to leave our bag here for now. Hopefully this will not end my death. We're going to progress a little further. Just going to head up there to see if there are in fact bandits up there. And what can be done about them. That marshlander was just waiting there in the... Hmm, interesting. end up dying from poison, man. And this guy just flat out dodges the shit out of my 
but I'm running out of stamina fairly quickly, and I'm out of boons. I need to wait for them to recharge. They don't even have chances to recover. They just die from my toxins. Based. I'm gonna eat your rations as well. Alright. realized that I don't have access to my guns. Wait, yeah, I do. I just don't have any access to bullets right now is the problem. On the bright side, I know where I left my backpack. So we're, sp we're supposed to flush out the bandits that are up here somewhere. According to my quest booklet here. Find the band of Hannah on spiralingly cliffs in the hollowed marshes west. Okay. Find the binded hand hideout. Once I find it, I should be able to commit it to memory. And I do believe I found it. There is a bridge right there. And there looks like seems to be a cave system right there. And there are more bandits right there. So... I think we did it, chat. Ooh, some nasty looking motherfuckers, too. Let's go for the guy with the great hammer first. He dodge hold that one. And you're dead. Fairly simple stuff. All things considered. I definitely should just consider going Hunter, since that's literally what I'm running. Did the other guy run away? He's missing. Suspicious. Where'd you go? Or did he fall off the cliff? Oh, I see how it is. Oh, man. Oh, snap! Crackle pop! Fuck! How did I not die from that fall? And now he has the high ground, chat. Shit, man. Oh, his attacks hit like a motherfucker. Like, wow, what was that? Unfortunately, I win. Your soul is mine. And eats your jerky too, just to piss, spit, just to piss on you. Pouch is overweight again. Now it's not as overweight, I guess. My armor is holding up as it is. So it looks like I was right. The bandits are hiding over here where the big tree is. The big tree which is just farting up some stuff into the sky. Contributing to industrial revolution and its consequences. There's a nice mo uh, iron vein here as well. Oh man, there's a lot more bandits over here. I should be able to take them out just fine, but... I just realized that I am... Kind of low in health. I don't have any bandages with me. And I probably should get some food. It's only 4.29 in the evening. Maybe I should have considered bringing a tent with me. You don't have any food. You just have an iron grade hammer. Alright. We're going to head back down. We're going to go ahead and grab our bag. 
I'm probably going to kind of have to convert most of this equipment into steel shards to use for my traps after all. I could go back and sell them, but I'm not exactly dying for money right now. It could also be I'm getting a little bit lazy. Okay. feel a pain watch having to destroy all those equipments that I could have sold but I mean I need the metal shards I need to create more weapons for myself I need more trip wires I need more iron spikes for the amount of bullshit that I'm gonna have to deal with fairly soon These are the hard choices that this game makes you take sometimes. You can, as unfortunately, in spite of my best efforts, you just sometimes you just cannot be a loot hobo in this game. Sun is beautiful, but it looks like it's going down. use some of these fangs to, for my traps as well. Warhorn bow is starting to get a lot of use, huh? Hey Asha, how are you doing tonight? I'm having a great evening. Thank you for stopping by. <laughs> Always good to see you. got here. Six of these and five trip wires. Could always use more trip wires. Aw, thank you for giving me something to eat. Unfortunately I don't have my 3D avatar out right now so it doesn't actually do anything. I'll need to refund that at the end of stream. About to do work but I wanted to stop by before doing so. Oh I really appreciate that. Thank you for stopping by. I hope you have a good day at work. I also just remembered I left some traps down there. I should probably get those back later. I'm like a weird, some weird mixture of rogue and knight and mage. 
definitely a jack of all trades. And only a master of setting up hundreds of tripwires with which to cheese enemies. And now, we attempt to shoot them from uh, all the way across the map without missing, without wasting arrows or my cooldowns. Alternatively, I can actually get closer so that I can guarantee that they'll be hit. I want to kill the mage first, honestly. Fuck. Alright. Kill the bowman first. Wow, look at this guy. He has some skills. Nope. Nice try, buddy, but no cigar. <laughs> nah, I'm carrying too many fucking arrows now. Equip arrows. But I'll take your salt. Always need salt in this game. Oh, hey, it's the uh, Marsh Witch. Hi there. Come closer, why don't you? Come closer, why don't you? Come closer, why don't you? Ow! Shit, man, I took so much of my health off. Holy shit. I forgot they do that. You gotta kill these people quickly, or dodge out of the way, or they're gonna do that. I can't believe I actually still managed to lose that fucking witch. And I've been dragged back to Monsoon. Great. Ah, frustrating. Well, at least we can unload the uh, spoils while I'm here. I'm surprised my food hasn't rotted yet. It's probably going to any minute now. Eat them while you have them. It's not even that late. It's only 3 in the afternoon. Is there something you need? Hmm. Greetings, friend. Do you have any hides? I could really use some hides right now. Coral horn antlers. You only got one hide and you're selling for 16 silver? What a ripoff. I guess buyers can't be choosers, huh? Fine, give it to me. What am I gonna sell, chat? Why does this weigh 4.8 pounds? Holy shit. Okay. Now, what do I need? Let's try wearing scaled clothing. Even though it doesn't look like it gives that much resistances. I mean, 13 impact and 15... Slashing? Not sure if want. But it does give you a damage bonus of 15% for some reason. So... I can't even craft that because I don't have Greetings, enough friend. hides. That's not something I would exp I expected that I would be expected to be saying either. Uh,
Where is the general store again? Oh, right. It's over here. How can I help you? Since when did you sell a brutal axe? Did I sell that to you? Do you still have it in your inventory up to now? Dang. What can I do for you? Honestly, what I should probably be doing is probably crafting these things and then selling them back to the shopkeepers. Wow. Well, that's a nice looking spear. It does lightning damage. None of you guys sell hides, do you? Sad face. Can I help you? Alright. It's time to stop fooling around. How much can I sell a fang halberd for? If I just buy a cheap iron halberd from that guy? What could I do for you? An iron halberd bought from this person is 25 silver. Okay. <laughs> so let's craft um, a fang halberd. I have a fang halberd now. What can I do for you? Let's sell the Fang Halberd for 19 silver. The Fang Halberd costs more to, it costs less to sell than it cost me to purchase the Halberd from him. That's such a pain in the ass. Great. I really lost out on that transaction. I mean, I might as well just sell all my Predator Bone. It's so like I originally intended. Because what the hell am I going to do with these? I can't even make a scaled... It's getting nighttime, which means my alpha sandwich is going to spoil fairly soon. But at least I know how to make alpha sandwiches now, and they can be made in an worker forest fairly simply. Whether I like it or not, I will have to go to bed. In game, I mean. Because I got my ass kicked. I need to be a little bit more serious about fighting these things. I could have just put them in here, honestly, and they wouldn't have spoiled, but I'm dumb like that. We'll keep that with us. Okay. Let's try again tomorrow morning, chat. Repair our equipment a little bit, and sleep the rest. At least we know where the bandits are hiding, and we did kill a great number of them. I'm 
so mildly annoyed that I actually lost money on that series of transactions just now. I definitely should consider just getting getting some hunter skills since I like to use these so much. But I don't know. Can I craft a better helmet? What do they got going on here? So with a makeshift leather hat, I can just... How do I make this? Do I just get two pieces of hide? Is that it? Two in the morning. Open trader backpack. Eat some food. Eat some food. Drink some water. Say some prayers to Allah. And let's go ahead and get going again. Make sure I have... Uh, let's try it again, chap. I hope we don't spend all session tonight just here, just in the marsh. I guess that if we complete this quest go quickly enough, it shouldn't be a problem. But still, getting my ass kicked by that freaking witch was no bueno. I could have just used cool though. They're giving me some resistances to cold magic. Hopefully, I don't need to get this too distracted by killing dinosaurs in the way there. Alright then. We are back outside, chap. We at least know where to go. So it's not all bad. This place is beautiful. So much of it's still left to be explored as well. Oh, a dinosaur. Always got to kill these stupid dinosaurs. Vengeance for all the trouble they've given me through the playthroughs of this game. Every time I think that I should switch to the war bow, this coral home bow does a lot for me, especially since it causes pain. Like, pain as in the status effect. Wait, really? Did I miss? Didn't miss that though. Do I have blood? Am I bleeding? I am bleeding. I'm no longer bleeding. Oh, 
That is worth it. Hmm. Blood mushrooms. These should prove useful. Speaking of mushrooms, there are mushrooms that keep growing in my avocado tree plant, tree pots. And they aren't the edible kind either. I'm fairly sure they're not even hallucinogenics. They look like destroying angels. So, I keep tossing them, but more keep coming out. I probably need to kill the mycelium, but it's kind of hard to tell what the mycelium is and what isn't. Or where it starts, I should say. Eh, more dinosaurs. Easy as pie, though. Hope my coral hone bow does not fail me anytime soon because I have great need of it. Pretty sure that one's dead. That red circle around halo around them means that they're suffering from pain. Pain really fucks you over in this game, not gonna lie. If you couldn't tell from the way these things have just been falling like flies. I love this bow so much. Dying standing up is really nasty, not gonna lie. It's hard to believe that it's still really early morning in game. Kinda wish I could use this campfire. Well, there's another campfire ahead, so it's not all bad. Always gotta drink, take a drink of water, a hydrate redeem for my character. And eat some food, which apparently I did not bring with me this time. Good thing I harvested some meat just now. I'll have to take a bite out of my spoils for a bit. And we'll make our way back up the darkest uh, cliffside. The campfires I left there should still be there. So we'll go ahead and make use of those. And of course, bring my spike traps with me. Did you hear that? Fucking witches. That's it. Who wants some? I do not want some. Because right now, I'm kind of suffering. Need to get some distance on this chick. Huh? What the fuck do you mean? Ow, fucking shit. Been killed again. And I've been sent to Monsoon again. <sighs> this game is unforgiving as hell. Of all the times to not bring my cold resistant gear. Why I'd have to be here.
No gravel beetles? Alright, again, let's try this again, what time is it, it's 9 in the morning only. Forget to reload my gun. Do I have any steel shards? No. I don't have any steel shards this time. At least I can call upon that whenever I need it. I wonder how long the cold boon lasts anyway. I haven't met anyone who teach I have not met anyone who can teach me the shooty McShooty ice spell yet either. Boon I'm gonna get for casting this here. Lightning resistance? Interesting. Oh, for fuck's sake. Man, they are all over the place, aren't they? They're like insects. Ah, <sighs> give me your shit. Equip. Keep that there. Thank you. And we are going to buy, make a shotgun. And kill the shit out of this guy too when he comes around the corner. He's hiding behind the corner. I 
hell? I didn't even have to aim that time. Still took some damage though. Definitely need this. Definitely need that. Thank you. Who else wants some? Getting really thirsty out here as well. Another Tyrannosaur, or whatever you call they call these things. Another victim of my greed. Or I could fucking miss again, you know, that's also great. Got you. More meat. More bones. More body parts. Can have a nice victory snack. I forgot that I have life potions. I could have just been healing myself this whole time if I really wanted to. More bandits. God damn, there are a lot of bandits in down here. What's up with that? Like, seriously. And one of them's a cold bandit, too. This is the game where when you think that, oh, you want to be play fair, the game does not play fair with you. So you're cruelly reminded that the best way to play this game is, in fact, to cheese it through any memes possible. I'm out of ammo. Great. Ah, shit. That still managed to hit me. Oh, my God. I like the fact that as frustrated as I get in this game, I do like the fact that it forces you to treat every encounter as if it might be your last. You might be doing great for a whole session and then BAM! Getting fucking TKO'd by the same Ice Witch three games in a row. What's up with that? No one to blame but myself. Like a fighting game. I'm running out low on bandages at the moment, chat. I really need to make or find a campfire for all this good junk. The respawn rate in this map is obscenely high. I mean, look, there's already dinosaurs here again. 
I just finished killing all those goddamn dinosaurs. Like, there's three of them, too. What the shit? Or is there only two of them? They're only in pairs, right? And I go through water like nobody's business. Reading well tonight, Martha. I do kind of feel like Turok, dinosaur hunter right now. Just with as many dinosaurs as I have killed since starting tonight, today's game. Which is to say, I've killed a lot of dinosaurs now. And taken over their, taken their hides. I should really, what I should probably be doing, if I was playing this smart, is constantly getting the habit of killing bandits, killing dinosaurs, and then making weapons from their parts, and then selling them back in town to make a profit. I'm just kind of triggered with having died so many times now to these stupid things. Not a single death to a dinosaur yet, actually, which is interesting. Of course, I could always change, given that I just changed myself. Hmm. Fresh hell is that? A phytosaur. Will RNG favor me and finally give me that which I seek? It's just a body. Okay. Ah, oh, there's some live ones right there. Turok, dinosaur hunter. Hunting dinosaurs. Did I mention that pain causes dinosaurs or causes en enemies to slow? Oh man, I'm running low in stamina. Like, really low. Where is my water? I'm being very liberal with my use of arrows because the fact is, I will not be starving for arrows anytime soon. I pick them out of the bodies, I make new ones. Easy game, easy life. Let's have some grilled marshmallow for once. 
Very nice. What buffs does this give me? Oh. What do you know? Grilled marshmallows actually give you a lot of stamina recovery. I did not realize that. It's good to know. I probably forgot that because I haven't used them in that way in a long time. I just assumed that they are only for poison recovery. Now that we are armed with this knowledge, let's go ahead and continue all the way back towards the bandit camp. If we're lucky, maybe we could find a sleeping bag that's already in there that we can commandeer for our purposes. Do these bandits respawn? Looks like there's only one of them now. This must be the one that killed me last time. Fuck. I legitimately can't tell if it's actually hitting them. If he fall keels over, we'll know for sure. Oh, that one hit him for sure. Yeah, that one definitely hit him. Got you that time, though. Bitch. Oh god, what a fucking battle that was. I wonder if I can even recover all my arrows. Oh. Marsh Archer. Iron Sword. Can I make anything with Iron Sword right now? No. Scrap metal you become. I'm gonna keep all my spike traps over here in case I need to run people through them. Got uh, some sort of complex over there in the distance. That must be the dark ziggurat. Thick oil. Iron scrap. That big ass tree that's smoking. These trees look kind of creepy. Almost like they were alive at one point. Enter the dead roots. Uh, how about no? How about we go ahead, pick up our tr many, many, many tripwire. Ah, uh, we got a bunch of tripwires here. Maybe this will be enough. Famous last words. It's probably best to save space anyway. We're going to murder everything that breeds and lives in this cavernous cavern. But first, we're going to run everyone through tripwire. What's up? He's gonna sit there. <laughs> nope. I shot first, baby. I shot first. Hmm. 
Hmm. Can't make anything out of this? Dumb. Oh, ho, ho! I've been looking for one of these. Should definitely serve me better than my padded helm. We could even compare it, actually. Very good against poison. Cool. I am your father. What do we got here? Oh, a toxic charge. Huh. Some money as well. Cannot see shit, Captain. That's very dangerous. My death is impending. And definitely sell these off for profit. Turn on my light here. Oh, shit! Freaking ice witches, I swear to god. What the fuck? Where'd you come from? God damn. Spooked the shit out of me. Spooked the shit out of me, chat. I don't like being spooked. These people will pay for the spookening that he gave me just now. And how? I didn't even see where the ice witch came from just now. Seriously, who shot me just now with ice powers? Where are you? Oh, there you are. What the sh- Oh my god. Well, it turns out that using the ice spoon to help protect myself from damage from ice attacks working as intended. I wonder if there are any more of you down here. Ah, oh, there's one. You look a little bit different. Only one of you? Alright. Flawless victory. I'm glad to see that so many of you have po have uh, anti-poison potions. Damn, though. Wonder what like what the puzzles are like in this map, or if it's just all fighting, all the time. Got some blood shrooms over here. I'm gonna do a little trolling. Oh! You took that one like a champ! 
He took that one on the chin like a champ. This one is a significantly stronger mob. Oh shit, there's two of them. No bueno. Let's retreat, beat the retreat really quick. then who wants to play ow oh, fuck and you're dead what about your buddy marsh archer captain huh more like marsh dead captain I'm gonna use this thank you for the life potion clip that and To... Where's your buddy? Ow! Wow, that shit did a shit ton of damage after all. Looks like you can actually cancel their attack animation if you attack first. That's also good to know. Can you eat some of your jerky and steal your cloth? Off your body. I wonder if I could turn the Iron Great Hammer into anything. So. Hey! I made a Fang Great Club! Very based. I'll sell that. I'm glad I'm finally making use of these parts. Looks like my discipline's starting to wear off. Has already worn off. Some cages. Interact with note. Instructions from the boss and Berg were clear. Never let those monsters near the prison cells. They will slaughter the prisoners out of sheer instinct. We can't keep kidnapping more of Elat's missionaries without risking serious consequences. You don't say. Hmm. What monsters are they referring to, I wonder? Do I even want to know? I wonder if I have to, have to fight a horror or two while I'm down here. I hear a chittering noise. Could be giant insects. Your failure in a recent raid is unacceptable. There can't be witnesses. Do you know what the Sorobor Academy does to loose ends who screw up? We risk being eliminated if our operation is discovered. Is that clear? So the Sorbor Academy is the one behind this? Assholes. Here's some... Hmm. I see you hiding there. You don't think I see... Oh shit, why did I push the wrong button at that moment? Got you. Hey, good try. I can appreciate it. Hmm, interesting, I got new boots. Hmm. Let me check their stats really quick. Huh. Pathfinder boots are better overall, but these don't have any stamina or movement speeds costs. I'll keep them with the Pathfinders for now. Looks like there's only one left. No, make that two. Make that three. Oh shit, there's a lot of them. Time to break out the tripwires. I am out of tripwires. Great. I don't have any wood. 
But I do have... Only one of them? Okay, I can take out one. It's getting serious now, chat. Getting very serious now, actually. Make another great club with my parts. We got to reduce the weight. What the fuck? <laughs> Ow. Oh man. you so hard you got glitched into the roots and I'm going to be taking your hat. Now I can roleplay as a wizard chat. You know, if I wanted to do such a thing. I'm also out of water. What a bountiful, har a bountiful harvest. I'm getting really tired in game though. It can be quite troublesome. I know there's one left. Looks rather tough too. Two hander sword? Yeah, this is definitely the boss. The boss of this gym. Oh man. Ow, shit. That hurt. That's a big sword, too. And he could take a beating. Holy shit. Pathfinder Claymore? It's mine now, bitch. Bread of the Wild? This guy was packing, man. Teabag, teabag, teabag. Yeah, man. This, this guy was packing. I need to get out of this place with all my loot somehow. This is a 39 damage, uh, 10 slashing, 29 poison, impact of 39. Inflicts vulnerability to all non physical elements on enemies. Huh. Okay. Very good. <sighs> we need to continue our exploration, though. Really hope there's... I really hope that was the last of them. But somehow, I have a feeling it is not. Give me my lantern. Need to be able to see. Crimps. If I had an alchemy kit right now, I could use that. Another dead body. Oh, a worker's corpse. Raw alpha meat, marshmallow. Oh my god. If only I had campfire equipment right now. This would be so good. But there is no wood down here. At least none that I can mine. Dinosaur. Dead Roots key is required. So this confirms my unfortunate suspicion. I have not killed the last 
there's definitely more to this dungeon than we have seen so far. Oh, here we go. This might be proved to be our... Unfortunately, I'm still way overweight for this area. I need to drop some of the heavier gear I have. We'll have to pick that up again later. Brutal Club, Small Sapphire, Seaweed. Oh yeah, we're definitely going to be looting the shit out of this place. You can believe it. Who else is left? Huh? Corpses. Another crimp plant. Oh, fuck. How did I not take any damage just then? I must have just missed it. If I catch you talking to the test subjects one more time, I swear to all out, I will have your head. If they catch, uh, if they find out that we are trying to learn to manipulate and control them, they will slaughter us all. You have seen what they've done to the prisoners. Do you want that to be us next? Interesting. <laughs> I, at first I thought they were talking about Tyrannosaurus, but now it's obvious that they're not talking about those at all. They're talking about something. Something sentient. I have an idea of who it might be. Unfortunately. A good idea indeed. The pieces are coming together. Someone from the Sorobor Academy is arming these bandits, but for what end? You're not quite sure. You should let someone power in the blue chamber collective know. Hmm. The Chamber Lord of Monsoon would also probably be very interested in knowing that such a dangerous group has been operating so close to a city. All right. Go to the city of Berg in Edinburgh Forest to warn someone in position of authority. Present the evidence to Lockwell and Monsoon. So many choices, so little time. I yo, a separate entry, a separate exit. I'm not leaving this place without the Pathfinder Claymore, that's for damn sure, but I can return and go get the other armor pieces that I've left here. I am definitely going to be looting the place out, the hell out of this place. For my trouble, I need to make money, you know? I just realized that the desktop audio of this game has been fairly low. No one's commented on it, though. I guess it's pretty loud regardless, isn't it? Damn, it's late in game. Where are we? I have to remember this. Another Iron Great Hammer. Improvised Bedroll. These are all good things. Let's take a break for the evening. And we'll go to we'll wake up tomorrow. Fully renewed strength.
This is the entrance, right? Where am I? Alright, let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle if we can. I think we have to scale this uh, small hill over here. I don't have any water to drink. Did I just soft lock myself? Oh no. Oh no. Fuck. I just soft. Oh, wait. Can I escape? Can I get out of this? I just soft locked myself. God damn it. Alright. I hope I didn't. Like, the game didn't save there. Or that's gonna be a pain. Let's try it again. Try this. I'm actually going to be low-key kind of annoyed if that actually saved it right there. No! Game! Why would you do that? Of all the places you could fucking save, why there? The only way I can get out is if I kill myself. Or if I, like, wait for myself to die from exposure or something. Or, like, explode myself, but I don't have any poison pills with me. So I can't kill myself. Give me one second, chat. I need to fix this. Which, and by saving, by fixing this, I mean I'll need to find the outward save file. I'll need to delete the most recent save file, and you know. These are all where to find them for Steam. Where's the one for Google Games?
People, 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 where... I need to know where it is for Outward, not for Steam. I need to know where it is for good old games, not out, not Steam. All right, now let's try it. Seventy nine hours spent on this game so far. And I will not. This is the first time I've actually had a legitimately game breaking issue that requires loading a previous save. Because that's ridiculous. I have I am not going to lose this playthrough because of something so dumb as being soft locked by loading by freaking getting stuck between literally a rock and a saw in a hard place. Or rather a hill in a hard place, I should say. No, apparently that does not, that is not where it is either. All right. Apparently the last save was 20 minutes ago. So we're going to be loading this one from 1033. Hope this works. Game, please, for fuck's sake. What the hell?
Turn off sync. Okay, now force it to run. Okay, fucking finally. Wait, wait a minute. Where is this? Oh, are you fucking serious? Where's my recycle bin? Where is... does Windows 10 even have a recycle bin anymore? All right, let's see if this one works. All right, fine. Debug mode outward. Where's debug duck text?
cool. So there is a I'm stuck mode to remove you if you fucked up to that degree. Honestly, that should be just on by default or something. If they still have this problem where some there are some areas where you can literally get stuck. Because that's fucking insane, man. I am not giving up a 79 hour playthrough because of something so dumb. It feels almost like these options should have been in there by default. Why the hell do I have to search and unlock these features? Like, come on. <sighs> Fucking finally. Thank you, game. Jeez. Holy fuck. And there, I hope it saves properly. As God intended, I don't feel like running through that whole section of the game again either. As fun as it was... I'm just kind of, it's kind of, this uh, whole thing just kind of spoiled my mood, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to leave the, I'm going to leave the debug settings on as well. I know it said, oh, well, you should totally turn those off during normal play, but nah, fuck that. Because I don't want that shit to happen again, and then I'll have to, and then I'll forget how to fix it, and then... Yeah, I'm kind of triggered. And by kind, I mean extremely triggered. So. Let's go ahead and get back into the game, shall we? Camp, once again, it took us two hours just to do that mission. Mainly because of how many times I had to die on the way there. I want to get out of the marsh, but I do need to head back to town. I need to complete some quest lines, and then I need to come back, pick up all these stuff that I dropped, and sell them. Make the monies, make the golds, purchase all the skills. <laughs> Alright. Now, where was I? Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, am I not supposed to be able to get up there? Well, I did it anyway. Alright. I could probably go along the beach. And I don't have anything to drink. that a bridge? Some spoiled water down there too. Man, maybe I should just go ahead and boil some water. My thirst is getting tense. I wonder if I can pick these flowers. No? Looks like there's a tree over there as well. I need to remember these bridges for next time.
You're not gonna let me pick this tree or cut this tree down, game? I see how it is. This area looks familiar. I, if I didn't know better, I'd say I've actually been here before. In fact, I probably have. Where's my water? Did it vanish? Here it is. Okay. Let's get going. Heading straight back to town. Gonna sell my wares. There's an alchemy kit here too. Some silver as well. It's actually nice outside in the marsh for once. Oh man, I'm lost. I have a feeling that this is not this was probably not the way out. Where the hell am I? Because there's the Dark cigarette. Oh, I made a fucky wucky chat. <laughs> this was not the way out. I'm over here. Great. I guess I could just run across the. But if I do that. I think it's sick in the marsh water. I mean, I got antidotes, so it's not that big of a deal, I guess, but... Still. That was maybe a little too ballsy. Let's head back to town. Before I do something even more stupid. Like, uh... Go to the Sorborans here and sell my wares and then go straight back into the marshland, into the dungeon to get more stuff. Oh, and what do you know? There is actually a freaking well right here. Ah, there's a primitive satchel too. Wait, why is there a primitive satchel here? An iron spear. Did I drop these here? And a stealth potion. Greetings, friend. I don't know who I am. I don't know where I am. All I know is I must wiggle. Aw, I always appreciate you, Wiggles Aislin. How are you doing today? <laughs> More wiggles. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. 
wiggle, 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 Doing well, thanks, myself. Uh, you just missed me raging at the game, actually, because the game um, hardlocked me. Until I found out how to turn on the developer, and I couldn't reload a save because the most recent save was outside of this dungeon that I spent a good, like, a half an hour going through. So I was trying to get pissed, and then I found out the, the uh, debug options not only let you reload past saves, it has a section called I'm Stuck, which literally teleports you a short ways away from the soft-locked area. Yeah, exactly. My Gamer Rage was raging like no other. So you miss you miss that. Um, but I found... And I don't understand why that wasn't already part of the options to begin with. But you know what? I was able to get out. I didn't have to lose an hour's worth of gameplay. So I guess it's all good in the end, right? I guess it's all good in the hood. And the game even rewarded me with this caravaner right here. Three so I don't need to run all the way back to town to sell my crap. I can just buy, sell it here. So that's better. I'm going to head back into the dungeon now. Loot the shit out of everybody I see. And, you know, um, sell it back to this caravaner too. I'll swallow it until you bet. You bet. So. Greetings, friend. We're going to head back into the dungeon really quick. We're going to loot the rest of the said dungeon. And then we're going to go back there and we're going to sell the shit out of everything that we have looted. First, though, I'm going to make a... Ooh, Fang Trident. I'm going to sell friend. you this as well. For big monies. By the way, do you like my new sword? Do you like my new sword? I killed a big-ass... I killed a big-ass motherfucker for this rusty piece of shit. But it looks cool, so that's all that matters. Alright. 58, 3.375. Do I want to keep this? I probably should, because even though it does 10 slashing damage, it does 29 poison damage. That's kind of a lot. And also inflicts vulnerability to all non-physical elements on enemies. I don't know what that means. But needless to say, it's definitely better than my own my other claymore. All right, so we're gonna head back now, inside there, and I do that by literally just walking across this, and either eating, and um, eating like a fucking where's the marshmallow? The marshmallow? The marshmallows are gone, or taking an antidote. And there's so many antidotes. This bit, this dungeon can hold so many antidotes. See? Easy as pie. No big deal. Alright. Let us head back inside the darkest dungeon. <laughs> and what a dungeon it was, let me tell you. If I'm lucky, a caravaner won't move, so I can just come back out and sell the excess stuff to him again. Almost threw myself off a cliff just then. Let's eat some food, chat. Eat some nice, delicious cooked meat. Drink us some waters. We continue 
our run. You know what? I just realized. Um, I'm wearing anti-poison armor, right? So these shouldn't be, are these things keeping me from? Are these the reason why I'm able to just travel through the the uh, poison river without it? I just got raided by I'm not a pyro. Thank you so much for the raid. I'm not a pyro. Flame is coming. The pyro squad has arrived. Welcome raiders. Aislinn, do you mind shouting out? Uh, I'm not a pyro, really, for me. Demon was to howdy 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 welcome raiders i my i am luller hicks i am a shit poster ai tonight we are playing outward and open world survival rpg um probably one of my favorite games ever in spite of all the raging i just did earlier um why did i equip that put in bag light up please Oh my god, thank you so much for the bits, Vex Ray. It's been a long time since I've gotten bits. Um, and uh, thank you for the bits. A thousand, ten, one thousand bits also, but it's been a while since I've gotten so many bits. I usually have a 3D avatar, but I'm using a PNG one right now because um, my computer does not like running my VTuber programs and also Outward at the same time. So I apologize for that. Vex, what did I say about that? What do you mean? What do you say about that? By all means, if you want to give me money, I thoroughly appreciate it. But it is not necessary to give me money. Um, so, uh, welcome everyone to the stream. Um, I'm a variety VTuber. I stream variety content. That is a shovel. I do everything from creative writing to um, FPS games to fighting games. I actually have a tournament, a uh, Guilty Gear Strive tournament coming up on Friday to um, virtual reality. Although I've been avoiding virtual reality for a little bit, but I'll probably get back into it fairly soon, all things considered. Um, I'm trying to remember how I, where, where was I over here? I'm not going crazy, right? Um, pretty sure this was the entrance to. Bruh, am I going nuts? I am going nuts because I could have sworn there was... Here it is, okay. <laughs> True, but we know Vex, huh, Pyro? First ads. Oh, I apologize. Oh, was there an ad playing right now? Much... I wonder how much of, my... of this spiel I was just saying got cut off just now. My bad. What did y'all last hear from me? I was talking about how I'm how I'm a ah fuck, really? Did I just forget that I was there? And now I'm bleeding to death again. God damn it! Ah, shit, man, spooked the shit out of me. Oh my god! You had three? There should only be three. There should be a maximum of three, yeah. You got. You shouldn't have five. That's weird. Um, there should be three play- there should only be a maximum of three. Dead Roots key is required. Dead Roots key is required. How- anyways, how you- as I was saying. Um, please do not use the redeems right now, they only work on my 3D model, but thank you. Um, basically as I was saying, I'm a variety VTuber. I play everything from FPS games to fight tens. I actually have a tournament coming up this coming Friday um, at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time if y'all would like to visit for that. Today I'm playing Outward, which is an open world survivor. I do allow links, yes. I am playing an open world survival game called um, Outward, Outward right now. Um, what else is I going to say? And I actually don't know what I was about what I was saying earlier, but something like that. Hi, hi, hi. I apologize for the ads. I have ads turned on not to make money because they aren't really making much of anything. 
but mainly to mainly so that the pre-roll ads don't run or they shouldn't be running there should only be a maximum of 90 seconds worth of ads so i'm surprised you got five I'm really sorry about that in that case first person to link me a photo of single paperclip gets a gifted sub yeah it is to an extent out of my control but thank you for understanding that's weird though um i killed pretty much every bad guy in this room so i'm surprised that the game is not giving me the dead roots keys that I, so i can open that section of the map i probably missed it somewhere it's probably around here somewhere because you know that's how these games tend to be right they just like to hide shit like that all over the place I need to dump some of my stuff here so I can actually. We'll go ahead and set to play this here. I need to reduce my load by around 8.4 more percent. If I had wood, I would just create a fire and start cooking some food. Hey, that I should be generous here. Yes. <laughs> um. Maybe I forgot the key somewhere up here? Who knows? Maybe I missed a uh, treasure chest somewhere? This is going to keep bugging me until I find a stupid key. Ah! Who goes there? What the f... What? What the f... Hold, hold, hold on, hold on a second. What? What the f... Oh my fucking... Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. What the... Oh <laughs> the... Uh... Uh... Excuse me one second. <clears throat> um, uh, ex excuse me one second. I, I, I need to, I need to leave this. I'll be right back. I'll be, I'll be right back. I'm back. I need to take a hydrate redeem for that, but in the meanwhile, I'm going to 
Um, I need to I need to take some time. I need to address that just now. One second. Thank you for the hydrate, Redeem. <laughs> Just like I am, I'm honestly shocked right now. Like, I I don't I don't even know what to say. <laughs> honestly, um, this is the sort of thing that you that people see happen all the time, and they're like, "Oh, it'd be cool if something like that happened and whatnot," and then. But it's like entirely random because you can't just expect people to just pop in out of nowhere and be like, hey, here's here's some money. And now I'm just like, what did I do to deserve this? Like, what the, what the fuck? That could have not come at a, at a better time. <laughs> Holy fuck. Dude, seriously, and my model's fucked up right now, but uh, I was like, like I don't, I don't know what to say. Vex, uh, Deathwish, thank you very much for bringing your friends over. You could have probably chosen God knows how many other people to raid, and you convince your friend Pyro to raid me, and that means a lot, but. This was so out of left field that I can't believe that that actually happened. Vexray is gifted 50 subs. Like, like, um, like, uh, like, like, wow, I, I don't, I don't know what to say, dude. I, 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 I don't, <laughs> one second, um, I need to move this. Uh, need to. move this out of the way. I need to fix the rendering option here to... Okay. Yeah, man. You know what? Fuck it. Just chatting. Go to just chatting. Like... I need to read back chat because I'm, I'm, so, I'm so sorry that I left chat for a second there. I was, I was just that shocked. <laughs> Uh, yeah, hype, hype, uh, death wish, <laughs> hype, 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 love you, Vex. There goes my leaderboard spot. Yeah, I, Aislin, Aislin, I love you too, but that, that was, that was so fucking out of his <laughs> rip. Bose, it was nice knowing you. Discord, Lamau, hey, hey, what do you do for a living? Do you guys hiring JK Asves? I'm not allowed to work yet. Welcome back, Hydrate Redeem. So yeah, I should I'm gonna go chug this thing of um caffeine water I got going on here. Um it's you know it's funny too is just before you guys came, I was busy debugging a bunch of shit going on with the game because I got soft locked pretty hard and I didn't feel like restarting eighty hours worth of gameplay. Um, so this just like, I, I've, it's been a roller coaster of emotions, man. I'll tell you right now, the money that I've made from this stream, what little there is, has gone chiefly back into upgrading the stream, which has so far included new memory sticks. A new graphics card, which really sent me back a lot of money, <laughs> and streaming equipment such as a boom mic, and a mic for that matter, and also programs. Um, that money, which is probably going to get dispersed by Twitch now, because, well, actually, Twitch has changed their disbursement system to where they actually start paying you if you make your make $50 as opposed to 100 So all that money is going straight to fixing things in the stream. I feel like my CPU is starting to die, so I might need to save up money for that. Or I might have to get a new MOBO too, actually, with the way things are going. 
uh, reading back through chat still, you said you need to hydrate. Yep, I just hydrated. There's my best friend Vex here. You have some powerful friends, Death Wish, I'm not gonna lie. Um, how do you know I guided a raid? Um, I just made the assumption that you guided a raid because I don't think I know who Pyro is, but I recognize you. I could be wrong. Um, we know your schemes, Death. Shush, I'm a ghost. I cause all the chaos and I enjoy it. Hugs, lulls time. Oh, thank you. <laughs> also, the re the channel point redeems work now because I switched to my 3D mode. So you could throw shit in my face again. <laughs> uh, it's no problem, lulls. It's normal for me to guide raids. Making things less jank is still jank, just less so. Yeah, but it is still jank. But God, man. Ow, bow, shout, ow, 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 thank you for the eating redeems. <laughs> Bruh, 50 subs, though. Oh, my fucking God. That's the most money I've ever made out of something that is not my real-life job. Just from doing something that I actually love. Thank you for the headpads. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be saying during the situation. Like my friend Mai, when she's, uh, when she, or uh, my friend, what the fuck just happened? Oh, thank you for changing or for doing the uh, samurai costume change, a cyber samurai for that matter. Like I've seen this happen to other people, and they've just cried on stream. <laughs> I'm not exactly in the cry mode, but I was actually starting to feel faint when I read over Streamlabs and read. Fifth, uh, Vex Ray has gifted 50 subs. <laughs> I love you too, Death Wish. But, um, oh my fucking god, uh, welcome to Lost Time, welcome to the stream. I mean, you guys have only been here a few minutes and, uh, was kind of in a bad mood just before y'all came, so I wasn't putting my best foot forward, which makes me feel bad, um, you always got to keep up impressions. Otherwise, why would people stick around to watch you, you know? Um, and, and now I'm just a fucking talking at my ass now. <laughs> but, um... So, yeah, that, that happened. Um, for those of you who are still here from the raid, if you would like to see more of my content, and you could also look... You can also watch back some of my, um... previous broadcasts and my VODs, and I also have a YouTube channel where I send all of my, um... All my vods. Uh, if this feels like the sort of thing you'd would like to watch on a four times a week, uh, feel free to drop me a follow. I just recently reached three hundred followers, and we're already quarter of the way next up to four quarter of the way on our way to four hundred, which is really exciting. I'm still planning some giveaways for having reached three hundred followers on Twitch and six hundred on Twitter, but I'm finishing up the previous giveaway i still need to do some writing for or some vtuber vtuber lore writing for another vtuber friend so once that's done i'm going to start doing giveaways for uh the 600 and the 300 um i would join discord but oh yeah death wish implied that they were under the age of 18 death wish uh, for what's worth i do very much appreciate you for um, respecting my respecting our rules that actually means a lot for a lot to me. You also probably noticed that compared to some VTubers, I do not have a do not interact policy on Twitter and Twitch. The reason for that being, let's face it, all of us have done the whole thing where they just sort of walk past the mature content warning shit. I can't really control what you do, and it's and my personal and my philosophy is. It's frankly not my responsibility to control what you do, um, but I do I mean we do control the do not enter the Discord if you're under the age of 18 because that's just for personal safety. You see VTuber drama all the time about bullshit happening in Discords between minors and people that are not minors. So that's really mainly for my safety and for your safety. Thank you once again for respecting that uh, content policy. Um, but once again, um, Vexray, if you're still listening in, thank you so much for the 50 subs. That really, really made my evening and probably made my week too. 
it's also going to be 50 people are going to be popping up being like, what the fuck? We got a sub. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Can't see. Uh, machine, got, get get this box off my head. Get, get ah. Anyways, I'm glad a little Ray can help your day. Well, yeah, it, help, it helps my day massively. Death wish like you have no idea. Thank you so much for being a lowly. Uh, within the context of our of our uh, channel, of course, I, I call my followers the lollies. <laughs> um, so yeah, that that was, you know, it's funny too. We only to we only have nine minutes left of stream. Usually, I go a little bit later on Wednesday nights because I get really into playing outward, and tr traditionally, I also like to end my outward streams having completed the quests that I set at the beginning of the stream, and also heading back to town so we're probably going to do that before we end tonight and i mean i'm i'm way too giddy and the uh water i'm drinking right now is spiked with caffeine so i'm not gonna be falling asleep anytime soon anyway um i'm talking so fucking much right now <laughs> i can't fucking believe but it's 50 50 <laughs> what the it's so i need to screech I need to screenshot this shit, man. What the fuck? Oh my god. I don't know what you do for a living, but you know what? Um, I, I don't need to ask. I, you know what they say, don't look at that gift horse in the mouth. <laughs> uh, what, what's American? Did I, had, did I screenshot the fact that a completely random stranger... Uh, just gave me, just gifted 50 subs <laughs> out of the goodness of their heart because they were suggested by her friend. <laughs> uh, caffeine water. <laughs> he gave you $249.50, yeah. Like, actually, you know what? No, it was more than that. It was closer to 269 or to closer to 259.50 because he cheered 10,000 or 1,000 bits before. That. <laughs> and some of these people, some of these were more than one month too. Some of these were two months and three months. Holy shit. What the? Oh my fucking God. Oh no. Oh no. What are you doing? <laughs> I feel bad too because I actually have redeems where the um where I certain things happen on VTuber Plus when people gift certain amounts of bits and subs and shit and stuff like explodes and stuff. I don't even know if they still work because I never gotten the chance to test them out. Um <laughs> oh, holy fuck <laughs> Oh god <laughs> No fucking way, Dex, you're not- <laughs> Oh my fucking god. Oh. Oh god. Processor usage is going through the roof. Um. Oh, I- Oh god, no. Oh uh, oh shit Oh god oh fuck 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 Um Yeah Can you even is is can I even be heard still? Is um is is my mic still running? My mic my mic is still running somehow. Uh, and the stream has completely destroyed itself because of the sheer number of subs that are going off at once. Um, oh my fucking god. I can't believe I made a chat. I can't believe I actually got my mind broken on stream. It's a good thing I put this actually in stream too. Uh, I can't believe my audio is still running too on top of that. And... Everything, the, uh, no, the confetti is still going off. I am still being, uh, murdered by balls of steel, by, uh, my balls of steel. The PowerPoint is still continuing. 
my arms have been destro completely destroyed. Um, yeah, so uh, that was a thing. 150 subs and 1k bins. I don't know what's got, or I don't know. Um, I'm assuming that's pretty much all the karma that I saved up over the past eight months of YouTubing used up all at once. <laughs> I actually had to lower the volume of my headset because it was so loud it was bursting my eardrums. Yeah, the stream has been completely busted. It's a good thing I switched to... It's a good thing I switched to, um... I switched to just chatting for that to happen because, um... Uh, yeah, that was a thing. <laughs> I can't believe you've literally gifted subs to half of my following. That's insane. Half of my following can now watch my streams ad free for the next for the minimum of a month. I have never seen this stream, this scene stream this laggy GTX seventy six mode or seven hundred and sixty mode. Yeah, uh, my pro my uh, GPU is being maxed out. It looks like um, actually, you know what? Surprisingly, the GPU is not being maxed out in spite of all this stuff happening. Um, the CPU is also is uh, jumping between low 70s and 100. It's finally clearing up a bit. VTuber Plus has just been stress test to hell and back, and I can't believe this was all met. We all managed to record all of this on stream as well. Winter has, co has come back. Hi, Winter. <laughs> um, Vex is probably going to break the stream eventually, probably. I, I mean, I'm surprised that it's not dying as it is. Um, usually when stuff like this happens, also the audio starts cutting out too, but normally the audio has not cut out. But um, in spite of that, uh, the balls are still coming. Um, you came back at the right time. The PowerPoint presentation is continuing, and it's a hell of a PowerPoint presentation as well. Um, uh, yeah, wow. It's, wow. Like, no, there's no way... Aislinn, there's I can't play power I can't play outward at the best of days with V2 replaced and also VC face running and I definitely cannot play it as all this uh, stuff is flying around in yeah yeah I'm not can I'm not even sure if I have it in me to play more video games tonight. I'm tempted to but um as it is the um balls are still coming the balls of steel I have never made so much money Dude, excellent. Do you know what this means? You, do you know realize what this means? It means that Twitch will have to send me a W two statement, so I have to that I have to report to the American government. I can I can actually use that to report on my taxes now, so I don't I can't just report it as um simple income. Well, I guess I'll just I guess it's simple. I guess you basically made taxes simpler for me now. Um, I can just plug this into my tax program and stuff. I to do it manually. <laughs> I'm a fuck Texas limo. But oh my god, I have never made so much money self employed before. This is more than my pay regular paycheck. <laughs> and all of this is going straight to. Dude, you've literally have given me so much money that I could. I could actually. I could actually now purchase a new MOBO and a new CPU, and I could actually build. A second PC using the other spare parts that I have, and I could actually do dual PC streaming now. <laughs> How does it feel to know that I brought in some friends to stream? Death Wish, it, I feel blessed. This feels like the culmination of months of. Well, I don't want to jinx it. I'm not going to. I'm not going to like spill the tea and um, do any dump any uh, trauma dumping or anything. But I just feel. I don't know. It doesn't feel good. This is the sort of thing that any streamer can only dream of. You know, much less VTubers. No one really does goes into this thing and things and thing. Everyone goes into this thing and thinks they're going to win the lottery, but. 
it's not just RNG. I guess it's a combination of just being the kind of person that is almost... I don't even want to say this wrong, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying, man. Death Wish, I don't even remember... I feel bad, but I don't actually don't, don't remember who I know you from. I know you're... I know I'm mutual. I know your mutuals were well, one of my mutuals, and I can't remember for the life of me which one. Because I try to make friends with a lot of people in the VTubing community. I don't even... <sighs> You're a friend of Wushu's. I'm gonna have to like pull pull Wushu aside and be like, hey Wushu, I just want to Wushu, I want to thank you for like befriending me like early, really, really early in my VTubing career and like having such a cool community and having cool friends and shit. Because one of your friends just brought another one of their friends who just gave me dropped seven hundred and fifty fucking dollars <laughs> for <laughs> Wushu is such a cool person. Are they are they streaming tonight? Oh, wait, they're, they're streaming every fucking night, man. I need to pop in. Yeah, I'm glad that I don't vex. Like, I have no words, man. You you have I have I have I literally have no words. I don't know what you do for a living, and I don't know what how what kind how you what kind of life you live to bring you up to be this generous. But I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart, like. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you so much. I, I, I don't, I don't know what to say. Man. I, I, li I really don't know what to say. I, I just, I, I, re I, I don't feel like I deserve this money. Like, I, I, I'm, I'm starting to have a brain fart, man. I just. Holy shit. Oh my god. I'm still here, chat. I'm, I'm still alive. I'm just... I'm lost in thought. Uh, my stomach actually hurts right now. Uh, half a year of streaming. Time to upgrade the jank. Yeah, man. There's... It's, it's time. It's time to upgrade, to do some serious upgrades. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put the sleeper together, Aislin. I got the parts. I got the graphics cards. All I, all I need now is a CPU and a MOBO. I can turn, I can finally put, I can finally make the sleeper PC that I've been talking about for a while. I can buy a capture card with, I can buy a fucking capture card. I can do dual PC streaming finally. I can. I, it's it's happening, man. It's it's fucking happening. <laughs> uh, I hate mobas, but I would not mind playing Apex with friends. I will say that much. In fact, there's a lot of game. The, there's a lot of games that I, I would not mind playing Apex with friends. I wouldn't mind playing PUBG with friends. I would, yeah. The only game that I'd probably still be on the fence about playing even with friends would be anything that requires instant epic, uh, just because fuck epic. But I would not mind playing Apex with friends even as much as I hate Apex. And I have played Apex before. In fact, I played Apex when it first released because I was buying into the whole oh respawn is looking out for the good for the little guys. And then they had, and then they had all the, all those hacking issues, and then it turns out that that was actually a guerrilla marketing scheme that Respawn did to get people to play their game. But uh, that was months ago. I don't mind playing Apex with people. I don't think I'd ever play Apex by myself, just because I would get really fucking bored of it really fast. Um, let me read back here. Uh, note. Uh, let's, let's see. Um, Wushu, I meet you from Wushu stream reading. Wushu was on the earlier ones for sure. Glad to be then saying you can use it. You can say it was me. No tomorrow though. You are very, very welcome. You can say it was me who guided a raid and brought an insane friend who was with your stream. Half a year of streaming. It's really no problem guiding a raid. I did it because I thought you was very cool and I wanted to do something to show you that I want to help out without having to send money that I don't have. Well, thank you so much. 
who says for expo who says exposure doesn't pay? <laughs> 150 subs going straight into big no. <laughs> Aislinn, I mean even as a joke, I, I was actually considering killing my miner and just turning that into a streaming PC into a dual stream PC. You know that PC wasn't originally meant to be a miner anyway, right? That was originally going to be a server computer for my gaming group. But um then the gaming group died, and it was then going to be turned into a Minecraft server, and then I fucking burned out of Minecraft, so it's kind of just chilling. Lol's actually Bitcoin. It's not, um, <laughs> eh, no, I am not going to use any of this money for Bitcoin or NFTs or stocks or any shit like that. This is all going strictly for improving my stream setup. I know Vex by now. We know each other for how for how long? I can't believe these the the balloons the uh, the subs are still going. We're still we're still going full we're still going full PowerPoint mode. No Bitcoin, only Lulz coin. Brace your bets now. <laughs> but yeah. Holy shit. So much money. I actually feel faint. I actually feel like the blood is leaking out of my head right now. Uh, next five streams are going to be PowerPoints. Oh my god. Oh my goodness gosh. You can't see it, but I'm leaning back in my chair right now, just because of how weak I feel, how dizzy I feel right now. You're getting some great aesthetics. Y'all are just taking clip after clip after clip after clip right now, aren't you? If you, It's fine if you call the stream, to be honest. I mean, I could call the stream, but why would I, but, I mean, we're still going through all these things, right? If I really wanted to stop all of these, um... Uh, subs going off. I could literally just, I could just um exit out of VTuber Plus and turn it back on. You know, um, I mean that's literally a thing that is possible for me to do. It is within my power. It's just at the same time, but like I know this is never gonna. I don't think this is ever gonna happen again. At least not anytime soon. So, I guess I'm kind of basking in the moment. Oh, Wushu is not live right now? God, of all the times for them to not be live, it just had to be tonight. I mean, there's a lot of other people that I'm sure they're alive right now that could that might appreciate the raid. Um, let, let's look together, chat. Or if there's anyone you would like to suggest that I raid, hey, check it out. It's, it's uh, the light at the end of the tunnel. I'm finally back. He's off today and yesterday? Oh. It's finally cleared. Yeah. I know a person. Oh, really? Uh, who is this person? Tell us, please. I'm popping onto Twitch right now. Oh, thank you for the through redeem. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. I can't believe it happened, though. I'm going to freaking... I need to screenshot this as well. In fact, it's so there's so many subs that it actually doesn't fit on the screen. Even on my um, vertical laptop, on my vertical monitor, it doesn't show up because there are literally just that many. Like that's that's how many. <laughs> Glorious Royal. It's still so laggy. Oh, thank you for the three redeems. You're trying to, you're trying to. Uh, lag me out again, but unfortunately it will not work this time because you need to have an obscene amount for it to work. <laughs> like, just out. Oh, thank you for the hydrated beams. Are you trying to drown me? Is that what you're trying to do right now? Glorious Royale. Let's look up Glorious Royale right now. Glorious Royale. Glorious Royale. What is Glorious Royale up to right now? That 100 subs really broke for a bit. Indeed it did. Glorious Rail is screwing around in red 
in Red Dead Redemption, it says here, R2-D2. They are Hispanic, and they do vaccine. They do voice acting, and they're also an LGBT alley. Well, Death Wish, in your honor, I am considering going to redeem them. Let me, uh, let me chug my water really quick. Let me chug my water really quick. Thank you for the costume redeem as well. Duggar, you might be interested in this. I heard that if you use Elgato Wavelink, um, if you use Elgato Wavelink, you can um, blessed. There's a new indeed. RTX, this is a very uh, blessed sound night. Sound dampening, sound gate thing you can download as a VST. Oh my God! On your thing, there's an update to it. All right, are we all set on going, going to Flores Real next, chap? Very flesh tuber. They're wearing a kitty cat headphones, and they are streaming Red Dead Redemption. Okay. Well, I mean, I'm good for whatever. It's just I usually like uh, raiding smaller VTubers, and a lot of my friends are also quite small. Um, and as usual, I have quite a few small tubers here that are currently online, including Jake Light, Ayanev, Professor Tetsuo, Roaring Nim Nim. I can play Aerosleth, Famkichu, Kurakanu, Neos, Vimoji. Millie is also playing tonight, some League of Legends. <laughs> I, I literally just took a shot in the dark, too. So, I guess it was kind of luck on my part. You sure? You're not going to be upset if I choose to not raid Glorious Rail? I mean, I'm sure he's a great person, it's just that... He has uh, 43 viewers right now and 4,000 4, followers, so I'm assuming that he doesn't necessarily need more viewers at the moment. Um, Millie is always fun, that's true. You sure? Okay. All right. Then in that case, we'll go ahead and uh, raid someone else. We'll be using the Lulz, the Lulz Wade Wiggles. Thank you very much, uh, Aislinn. Um, we are going to be raiding... Desk at work, a crowded bus, and every hmm. you paint a beautiful tree. Whether it's using the physical experience of traveling to help grow body awareness of the people around us is a key to practice kindness. Every situation and environment can be used in support of culture. We are going to be raiding. Try selecting a favorite card from the deck and see how you can practice the exercise. Is there a way to show more people that are happen to be streaming right now? That's where I know you from, Sweetheart Alley. Okay. I fucking love Just making Alley. sure. God, I meant Sweetheart Alley. Um, we could raid money. Millie tonight, money. actually. Or we could raid Aerosleth tonight, who recently came back to streaming and has around six followers. Hmm. Aislinn, we're actually going to raid Millie another time. We're going to be raiding... I think we'll raid Aerosleth tonight instead. Uh, okay. The reason being that... They are playing a similar game to uh, to what we were playing just now, and also because um, they have fewer followers, and they also just recently came back to streaming. Do do do. For those of you have not who have not dropped a follow yet, if you. I've you barely got to see anything besides freaking out from all the uh, subs and the bits. But if you do feel like um, checking me out again in the near future, feel free to drop a sub a uh, subscribe a subscribe and well, not subscribe a uh, follow. And I'll see y'all next on Friday when we play some Guilty Gear Strive tournaments. <laughs> Vex, if you're still listening in, thank you once again for all of the the many, many, many hundred, literally hundreds of uh, subs that you gave. Really appreciate it. And I will see y'all soon. Bye-bye now. Prepare for the Lulz raid. Yeah. Thank you once again, Deathwish. You have no idea what you've done for me tonight. Uh, I'll need to recover. I'm just gonna go fuck to sleep. <laughs> After I gush about this, of course, on Twitter. I wonder if I can just, like, do this by forcing it. Oh, man, I feel faint. Speed running. No, see, it's hitting all 
already. How do I do this? I'm so confused. My confusion is immense. Oh my gosh, long time. Thank you so much for the raid. Hello, hello, raiders. Welcome, welcome in. 